Hi, I'm Oscar van Deventer and this is Dust Cube 2. Dust Cube 2 is a variation to Dust Cube, which you have seen at another video of mine, and it's a twisty puzzle. So when it's solved, it looks like this. It is a smaller cube and it has some larger cube pieces around. However, there is something special about this cube. When you try to uh, turn it and scramble it, what you will see is that uh, in some directions it turns, but then when you want to turn it further it blocks. And actually it has a very special reason why it blocks, because the requirement is that all the pieces like this, so the larger cubes, should stay connected. So I can make any turn where they stay connected, but as soon as they risk of getting deconnected here, then the movement blocks. So this makes it uh, a quite interesting uh, puzzle to solve, uh, interesting puzzle experience. And uh, let me show you what's at the inside. So here we have 3D printed edges and the trick of the puzzle is that these three edges, one, two, three, they have a special internal shape. You see this one sticks out like this, the other one slightly less and here we have the third one that looks like this. So they are different and they can pass each other. So this one can pass along the other one or this one can pass along. So these are friends of each other, so they can pass along each other. However, the regular edges, they can't pass, so if a regular edge wants to pass against a special one, it blocks. So that is uh, how the mechanism works. And you may have noticed something special about the material. I used 3D printed wood to make these pieces and the 3D printed wood has some special properties why I like it. It turns very smoothly, it's easy to clean, uh, things uh, move along uh, quite smoothly, um, it's uh, easy to clean uh, the parts. It has also some disadvantages, it's slightly easier to break, with uh, a bit of force I can break off uh, this part, but still people uh, are using it uh, gently. So and you can see it really turns smoothly, the material comes out uh, uh, quite accurately and yeah, it works. And so for this one I've been using black 3D printed wood, but this is the mahogany 3D printed wood. So my question to you is, uh, what do you think about uh, printing 3D uh, uh, twisty puzzles? in 3D printed wood. Thank you for watching.